I'm Cameron Hodgins. I farm with my wife and we, we operate Hodgins Farm just outside of Lenore, Manitoba here. We got about a thousand acres mainly in perennial grass and forage. Some beef cows, a few sheep, a few pigs and a few beehives and uh, some pasture poultry. And we do some direct marketing but our main enterprise is the beef operation. I joined the Alice Assiniboine West Pack in March of 2020 and it's been a pretty invigorating experience. What attracted to me working with Alice is to, to work within the ecosystem and really work on generating some ecosystem services and creating a better water cycle, better grasslands or better natural habitat for some of the species that are around. To farm with the ecosystem is, is something that's really important to me and I just felt Alice was a way that you could help out and discuss different ideas and educate other producers or give them options to try different things. We've been utilizing adaptive multi-paddock grazing, reading the ecosystem, like this year it's been dry, so we really slowed down our moves, allowing the grass to regrow. So we're moving our animals on a daily basis, and it depends on what's, what size of paddock we're giving them, on the uh, on amount of forage that's available at the time. But the big thing is just allowing enough regrowth for the following season. It's the importance for me in, of doing environmental work on our land is that we've kind of really seen the economic impact of you know, having like all, just right behind us off-site watering systems to, to have fresh water for the cows and then it provides a habitat for different birds or waterfowl or aquatic creatures that are gonna thrive. And we've seen that impact where, you know, decreased foot rot as well as, you know, different managed grazing systems. We've, we've been able to get more grazing, more grazing days out of different paddocks and some better animal performance by managing different ways. But nature's complex. It's really interesting to see how the cows interact with the ecosystem once you start moving the cows on a more regular basis and then how they react to that and it's there's a lot of benefits whether it's they're easier to handle I know how many grazing days I get out of it and this is something I can do with my kids a lot of times I got two kids with me moving cows some producers in our area are ever thinking of working with Alice contact the, the watershed office and just get talking it's a great system it, it gives you some funding to maybe try something that you wouldn't want to go on risk by yourself and just help improve the ecosystem and they've got some knowledge there to, to guide you and talk to the right people and the system's worth it 100 percent it's it's a it's a good system and it looks after working within the environment making a few dollars and just make this whether it's our our land our watershed our community just a little bit better